Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to talk about interpretation. So in this one, we can use about interpretation by substitution. So I will put about u equals to 1 minus s y. So because this is about ds, that means when we do first derivative for the both side, this one that is about the constant. So you got number zero. This one we have number one. So we have negative y ds because we don't have negative y. So we need to divide both sides by negative y. Next, we need to change the bounds. So, when s equals to number 0, so I will put number 0 going here, and we got about u equals to number 1. So, when s equals to number 1, so number 1, I will put this one going here, and u equals to 1 minus y. So number 0, we change for number 1. Number 1, we change for 1 minus y. 1 minus sy, we change for u. So the s we change for the u over negative y. So the integration, uh, sorry, no the u in here. So the integration of one over u du. That is about Fn of the absolute value of u. And then we put the bounds from number 1 to 1 minus y dy. So I will put this one going here. Number one going here. And now we have like this. Fn number one, you got number zero. So in this situation, I will cancel the absolute value and I will put about the single bracket. Now, we need to create about the Taylor series. Or maybe I can use about McLaurin's series in here. So, in uh, this one, I will put about f of s equals to f n of 1 minus s. So the formula that should be like this. And so on in here. So first, the derivative of this one that is about negative one over one minus s. The next one that is about second derivative. So we have number one over one minus s. Everything to the power of two. 
and so on in here. So if I put number 0 going here, you got LN number 1. So this one, we have number 0. If we put number 0 going here, we have negative, negative number 1 over 1 factorial. This one we have S. If I put number 0 going here, uh, this is negative sign here. So we have negative number 1 over 2 as square. So if we repeat the process, we have like this. So now, we need to transform this one into this one. And we know that we have the negative sign here. So negative, we can show the negative sign here. And we just have like this. So this one that is about y. So we put about y divided by y. And we have number 1. The next one we have 1 over 2 y. 1 over 3 y square and so on in here. So the integration of number 1 we have y. The next one we have y square over 2. The next one we have y to the power of 3 over 3 and so on in here. So we put the bounds from 0 to number 1. So we put number 1 going here, number 0 going here. So in this one, we have like this. Because we have 1 over 3 multiplied by 1 over 3. 1 over 2 with 1 over 2, that's why we have this one. and so on in here. So in this situation, we can put about the summation and equals to number one to infinity. And this one that is about b square over number six. This is the end. Thank you for watching.